So something that you guys informed me of, thank you very much by the way, is because I turned off the lot challenge for being off the grid because it was getting too much. I didn't realise because I was being a bit silly. You have to go onto the mailbox, show bills and store all of your power and energy so that it actually lasts you a long time, which I didn't realise. So that's what we're doing now. Also, like Shanice's little baby tax credit, absolutely love it but I really can't deal with the object baby. So we are aging you up into an infant, which will be an awful idea, I know, but that's what we're doing. We do have a butler to look after the child. So like we don't have to deal with it. Tax credit age up and we're making it intense. Not my problem, it's the bloody butler's problem. <laughs> the child is like, oh my God, mommy, where have you gone? <laughs> For we are going to make some nectar because we still need to complete our aspirations. It's been a very long time coming. Have a simp stay awake for 24 hours straight. How did I get that achievement? <laughs> I just switched the game on. I mean, she's got high energy. I'm not sure what that was about. Oh my God, corn beef is getting on in years. Fanny fart is getting on in years. All of our ranch animals are gonna die soon. <laughs> what an absolute disaster. Though what's not a disaster is the progress of feisty flange, our horse. We still need to raise up all of our skills, hopefully up to level 10. We've got jumping left and the rest are all 10. Oh, we've got a champion horse trait. A champion through and through, this horse's foals will gain skills that fighting spirit faster and have hype. Does that make sense? This horse's foals will gain skills and that fighting spirit faster and have hype. I'm sorry, I'm so dyslexic. You read that for yourself. You interpret that for yourself, please, because I'm dyslexic. We're just gonna direct the horse to do some jumping while so we are dealing with the nectar. Oh, Fanny Fart has been unhappy for a while due to inadequate care. So looks like our cow is about to die or run away or something. I mean, we're feeding it. We are cleaning it when we can. It is dirty, apparently. Oh no, tax credit's very hungry now. Make sure to feed it before she gets taken away. Now the bloody infant is going to get taken away soon. <laughs> I mean, the butler should be doing it. The butler needs to be looking after my child. Instead, she's just flicking the table, pretending to be busy. She's a worse butler in the entire world. I mean, we've got attending minors as a responsibility. Like she should be doing it. Oh no, even our horse is very uncomfortable. Chlamydia carrots, I'm so sorry. By the way, the Sims team just released an update for the Sims 4 horse ranch, meaning that hopefully it should actually work a lot better now. So hopefully like we won't have to deal with all the bug. Well, it will still be glitchy for sure, but hopefully it'll be less glitchy. Ah, oh, look at that little pony. Can we pause? What was your name? Candylicious Clarence. You are so cute. I absolutely love you. And um, oh, do you know what I just realized? You're supposed to clean the horse beds. I genuinely like never knew you were supposed to do that. <laughs> like genuinely never knew. Oh, also before I forget guys. Okay, apparently because we've been having a lot of issues with the ranch hand, apparently it's a glitch caused by the community board. So if you get rid of the community board, apparently the ranch hand will come to you a lot and work properly. I don't know if that's true, but we are going to test it. We need to hire a service, but internet does not work without power supply off the grid. We do have power supply. See, this is why I don't get the off the grid thing because like we got solar panels, we got a wind turbine, like what more do you need? I mean, what if I use this household power generator? I mean, will that do anything? We're gonna have to wait and see. The baby, oh my God, I keep forgetting about a baby. Look at her face, she literally looks evil. <laughs> of course she's evil. She's the spawn of Shanice Shanice. So of course she's evil. Also, I keep forgetting, but we need to put up our trophies. I'm not putting up the silver trophies in the animal barn because I feel like the silver ones don't count. So instead, I'm actually going to sell the silver ones just for a bit of added money. On the subject of making money, like we're still making a lot of money from gardening. Oh, first blowout milestone unlocked. Yuck. It was bound to happen, but tax credit had her first blowout. So that means she had diarrhea poo. Hopefully the diaper will halt next time. That was literally gross. Um, Is the baby all right? Nobody's looking after baby and it's stinky. <laughs> I'm so sorry, madam. We are not looking after you at all. The most important thing, okay, is crafting nectar. That's what we really need to be doing. We're so close to completing our aspiration. We just haven't made that much money from it yet. Oh, look, Candylicious Clarence has come in to say hi while we're doing nectar. That is so sweet of you. Oh my God, you are beautiful. I want to cry. Oh, the other horse in the background. What are you doing, mate? You're having a conversation with yourself. Oh my God, he's hungry. I'm so sorry. Right, Chantal, wake up, please. Feed the horse before it dies and runs away. If this horse runs away, 
wait, I'm gonna be fuming. And we can hire a ranch hand now because we are finally in a power surplus. So that is great. Whilst that's happening, I think we should direct the horse again to practice some advanced jumps. I really want Feisty Flange to be high level. And um, oh look, the ranch hand is here. I wonder if it's the same one as last time. No, it's a new person. Hopefully she won't f it up like the last ones did. <laughs> Oh, at least she's looking after the cows this time as well. And um, oh my god, Shanice has finally made 50 excellent bottles of nectar. This is so exciting. Although she better go for a shower because uh, she's very stinky. But this is so amazing. And oh my god, look, these uh, ponies uh, chatting with each other. Isn't that cute? Feisty Flange is our poor competition slave. Like he's just being forced to do all the different jumping things. I feel a bit sorry for him, actually. Now, as a part of Shanice's aspiration, the only thing we need to do is sell nectar bottles. But here is my trick. There is a prairie grass spawner somewhere in this world that spawn. I think it's this one, but for some reason, like you can harvest it infinitely, and I'm not sure why. And it's very, very strange. Shanice is feeling never good enough from a fear of failure. They still haven't fixed that bloody base game bug with the fear of failure constantly. So maybe it was just an issue last time, but we were literally able to like harvest it indefinitely. I'm not sure if it's like a permanent glitch. Yeah, she's just she's just doing it like in infinitely from this one thing, <laughs> which is absolutely hilarious because we're finding honestly so much finely aged nectar, like we could just sell it. I mean, to be fair, like we got a lot of stuff in our inventory that we need to be selling. I think honestly, I might just get rid of it all because it's pissing me off a little bit. Oh my God, tax credits, baby print. Should we sell that too? <laughs> We don't need it. Although she's not finding much nectar anymore. Oh gosh, she's starving. She's got no energy. Right, Shanice, let's get home, please. And oh my, oh my God, my baby. Guys, no, like genuinely, I forgot about the infant. Look at its needs. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But like, we've got a ranch to look- Oh my god, even the butler looks confused. The butler's like, oh my god, I can't deal with this. <laughs> butler, are you gonna help? Are you gonna do anything? Oh, thank god. The butler is helping at last. Oh no, the baby glitched on the floor. Not sure what's happening here. Oh no, she's she's put the infant back. She can't deal with it. She's just standing there. I did. Oh no, she's ran away now. Nobody can deal with the infant. <laughs> Must be the bloody spawn of Satan. Though it's not Shanice's problem. But for some reason, time is not speeding up properly. I'm assuming, I bet that ranch hand is still here, aren't they? I know it's a butler. The butler's awake. That's why time isn't speeding up. Why is a butler awake now when everyone else is asleep? It's so annoying. I can't stand the bloody NPC townies. <laughs> they ruin everything. I mean, at least we're getting work done for doing absolutely nothing. It's, it's like passive work. Oh my god, Feisty is very hungry and will be taken away soon. Oh my god, Feisty Flange, where are you? You are not being taken away. You are not being taken away. Oh my god, starving. Oh my god, I'm so starving. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my God. I'm literally terrible. I'm God, please don't run away. We've done so many competitions with you. We spent ages raising up your skills. Do not die, please. I'm so sorry. It's not my fault. This ranch hand is doing a shit job. But my poor little horse, Feisty Flange, you are like the main character in this whole story and I've been neglecting you. I am so, so genuinely from the bottom of my heart. I'm so sorry. Right. Shant out. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to have a shower. We're going to get ready and we're going to do a really lovely competition with the horse because top tip when you leave a lot full of like starving sims you come back and they're all like well fed because the game autonomously they look after themselves it is it's not an exploit but it kind of is although before we go i am going to be searching this priory grass thing again just in case we find any more nectar bottles because like we really need them so we're basically at the right level i mean we, we're maxed out with all of our horse skills there's no reason why we shouldn't get gold as long as we fulfill all of our needs and we put ourselves in a confident mood. So Chantal, head over to this mirror. What's it? Sight yourself up. There we go. Easy peasy. And then the horse who's fanning around. What are your needs looking like? Oh god. Hunger low, fun low. Oh dear. We are feeding you a lot though, horsey. So I just realised you can hand feed like loads of random different things like a pair even. So that's quite cool. So it's just your fun is... How do you actually raise like a horse's fun need? It's very difficult. Tell a joke. Should we just like tell a joke indefinitely? And then, oh god, the hunger is low again. This horse is honestly hungry all the bloody time. This rate, Chantal, Chantal, she's not even going to be in a confident mood anymore by the time we've actually got to do the race. Right, the horse is 
fine. I think we need to put it in a good mood. Let's do jumping compliment jumps. Will that make you confident? Right, Charlotte, everybody's autonomously running off and not doing what they're supposed to do. We're going to have to pause. Maybe if we compliment on loads of like jumping things, maybe that will make us do better in the jumping competition. I mean, this pack is not that deep, so probably not. But all we can do is try. Right, it's not happening. Right, at least Chantal's in a confident mood. Let's give expert jumping a go. Oh, nice. We got a gold medal. Lovely. So doing a horse competitions is forming a part of our dailies, just as it is clipping through each other. <laughs> oh, God, the horse is weighing. The horse is weighing. Thank God I took a screenshot of that moment. That was a good moment to take a screenshot. <laughs> Chantal is depressed, probably because you just got weed on. Oh, also, I forgot to say, I heard that nectar bottles, they mature faster if you have a basement. In reality, what that means is we're building, like, kind of, not really a basement, but we're just doing this. And we're putting some nectar bottles down here. It can't be accessed by The Sims, but I can access it. Shanice is still sad from a fear of failure. What is her fear now? Fear of failure. Become recognized for work. The reason why Shanice is not being recognized for her work is because this pack was integrated terribly because she does have a job. What if we find a job? What if we register with the Ministry of Labor? Her job title is Nectar Making Slave. Maybe now the game will recognize that she does actually have a job. Therefore, her life is fulfilling. Who knows? All of our Sims are like asleep apart from Shanice. <laughs> I feel like we've just accidentally developed this nocturnal sleeping pattern. And uh, oh my God, what's happening? Fanny Farts time has come. Now they'll be strolling around those rolling green hills in the sky. Oh my God, the cow's dying. <laughs> Oh my god, what's that? Oh my god, the cow glitched. The cow wasn't even there. Like it, it, it was just invisible and it and it tele like what happened? The cow wasn't even there. Do you know what I'm do you know what I'm saying? Like the cow was invisible, so like it got taken away, but it wasn't even there in the first place. Shanice has lost it and she's having a conversation with the plant. Oh my god, Grim Reaper, can we plead for its life back? We can't. I mean he wants to have a chat with us. Should we give him a howdy introduction? Not that Shanice honestly like gives a shit that a cow just died. <laughs> I mean, this Grim Reaper, like he may as well just have like a little hut in his ranch that he can live in because he's here all the time from all the animals that keep dying. I hope he's getting paid overtime for his work. So another day of training. We've got the horse in a confident mood. We're getting Chantal in a confident mood. And I think we should try master show jumping today because our aspiration is about winning five gold masters. Oh no, we got a silver. <laughs> what actually determines, I feel like it's like a lot of the time just a gamble because like with the highest skills, we're both in a confident mood. Like what could have been wrong? Maybe it's just totally random. It's kind of annoying as well that you can't do a horse race twice in a day. I feel like it should be okay in the game to at least let us have two in a day. See, oh my god, look, Patchy has finally got up off his tree grave, whatever you want to call that. Will he finally help with gardening? Because that's what I really wanted to do. I just wanted a gardening slave, basically. Who knows what's going to happen? I'm just going to leave him to it. Whatever he wants to do, he can do. Where is he going, sir? Where are you going? What are you doing? Oh, he's cleaning up for me. Oh, that's so sweet of you, Patchy. Thank you very much. Where's he off to now? He's speaking to a naked Shanice. Lovely. And then now he's just distracting us from our nectar making, which is rather annoying, actually, seeing he's not doing any gardening at all. Also, Shanice has been gaining a lot of weight lately, and, like, I don't know why she's gaining the weight. At first, I thought it was because, like, she was pregnant. Now I have absolutely no idea why it's happening. Poor Shanice, she really is just a nectar making slave. She has been this whole let's play. <laughs> That's all I've been doing with her. Usually she's the main character, but on this, like, rare occasion, Occasion. She's not the main character. She literally just is a nectar slave. Although none of our nectar has actually become finely aged yet. And like it's been in there a long time. I don't know how exactly long it's supposed to take. And it's annoying because you can make more money by selling it to the mysterious rancher. But it doesn't actually count towards doing it actually as the aspiration. Even though it's supposed to because it says it does in the description. It's just a bug. Hopefully one day we'll be able to. If he ain't bothered to fix it that is. So we're back to doing competition. Competitions. I really want to get a master in something. Although we still need to do all the expert ones and work our way up so we can actually do the ultimate championship. I don't know what the requirements are to do the ultimate championship. I assume we've got to do all of the other ones first. So what's it going to be, Chantal? Oh, no, you haven't fucked it up for once. Thank you very much. We got a gold. Well done. And um, oh my God, I completely forgot about our chicken. Hopefully our ranch hand is actually coming in and doing things. No, the ranch hand has actually like fired themselves, but the game didn't tell me. So yeah, that's 
they're still broken unfortunately ranch hands do not work i do have some thoughts about the pack and i'm gonna reveal them as soon as i finish the let's play in full but until then do you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna move the snowman down why am i calling him a snowman he's a scarecrow <laughs> i'm moving the scarecrow down there and i'm making another nectar maker chant out she's got like no nectar making skill but if we get some different fruits we can get her to actually do some nectar making so that we can complete Shanice's aspiration faster because I'm sure if we just put the nectar that Chantal makes in Shanice's inventory it should count towards her aspiration because we've totally filled our nectar racks and like none of it's finally aged yet I think it's gonna have to get to a point where maybe we just sell it when it's moderately aged because none of them are aging finely even though it's been quite a lot of in-game days so now they're both nectar making slaves and this patchy is just annoying us completely I mean my theory guys we have 52 nectar bottles so far stored if they were all just 1000 simoleons each we could potentially complete the aspiration although they're not although some of them are a lot more maybe we should take a gamble and sell them all as moderately aged I'm not too sure I mean I am just selling them from Shanice's inventory now I do hope they fix a bug with the mysterious rancher so it's actually a little bit more meaningful also I highly doubt that selling them as a shop in a retail store is going to count towards it I did make a nectar making retail store but I just don't think it's going to count so I don't want to do it I don't want to undertake the risk I mean do we do okay I'm going to do the risky thing guys I'm going to sell all the nectar that's here and just see what happens it's a very risky move I know but we do what we've got to do so will multi-sex I mean multi-select <laughs> why are we talking about multi-sex there we go multi-select selling okay we'll make 36k from that and uh, now we're 18k away from our aspiration so we're a lot better off now maybe I could have been more patient but I chose not to that was my bad I could be wrong but I feel like strawberry nectar is selling the most so that's the one we're going to be doing I've just got her working on both nectar making machines like simultaneously <laughs> just so we can cue the action so we can make her do it faster though guys I'll be honest like honestly this off the grid lot trade keeps notifying me of crap and it's bloody traumatizing me like I wish it would just shut up I knew the off the grid thing was a bad idea but I did it again anyway and I should enough so time for another horse race we do master western pleasure again like i'll be honest like it does sound like a sex word do you know what i mean would you like a western pleasure <laughs> So come on, Chantal. I know you can do it. I know you can pretend to win this rabbit hole horse race. I know you can do it, Chantal. Oh no, the game's lagging. I don't think it'll work now. <laughs> Maybe it'll glitch. Is it gonna work? Oh, we only got silver. At least we finished half our aspiration now. We competed in 15 competitions. But 100% guys, back to the nectar making. Doing the strawberry one is such a good shout because we're making a lot of money off it. Also, I've been getting Chantal to harvest prairie grass from this infinite pile that's over here again like i'm genuinely not sure if it's a glitch or if it was on purpose but it seems to be infinite so sometimes she might find nectar bottles in there has she found any so far oh she's found four so far every little helps and oh my god we're literally less than two thousand Shanice, can you stop going back to your infant please we've got money to be making your child is not important we're less than two thousand away from completing it although it looks like chantelle has finished harvesting so it looks like it's not infinite it's just very very big i mean there was a lot in there even i'm a bit bloody surprised right shanice i know you're really really smelly but we've got some more nectar to make we are so close to completing our aspiration all you've got to do is make two or three more bottles madam that's all you've got to do you can do it i'm also gonna sell all of this junk that we found in chantal's inventory from harvesting all that grass thank you very much chantal but we don't really need any of this we may as well add it to our funds right shanice do you know what i feel bad she's so stinky she's probably gonna make the nectar really stinky maybe we should make her take a shower go on Shanice you deserve it because oh my god have we completed the aspiration <gasps> we've done it oh my god we've completed it that is incredible well done Shanice nectar making is truly an art and Shanice has mastered it those who drink the delectable nectar produced by her instantly know that it was crafted by an expert nectar maker a sim who has arduously perfected their craft Shanice should take pride in that she's earned a trait nectar to know it all these sims can craft pre-aged nectar have an iron bladder when it comes to drinking nectar and their negative emotions have less influence on their current 
mood. That is a very, very powerful trait. Well done, Shanice. You are a neck to know it all. That is so good for you, Shanice. I'm so happy. She's so happy she's having a conversation with the kitchen sink because she is that happy. Love that for you, Shanice. Although, I'm, uh, Scarecrow, can you just leave me alone, please? This guy is so annoying. I'm just trying to make my fruit salad before I starve to death. You won't leave me alone. So, time for another competition on a happy note. And we've got a gold. Absolutely lovely. Our first gold in ages. We're doing so well on our cute little farm. Isn't this so beautiful? We've got all of our, an well, some of our animals. Most of them have actually died. Wonder how the little mini goat's going along. Testicle is dirty and unhappy. Like, to be fair, like, who's been feeding him? Because it hasn't been me. Who's feeding this bloody goat? <laughs> who's feeding the little chickens as well? I haven't been feeding them at all. I haven't even been collecting their eggs. I've just forgotten about them. Or it, or however many we've got left. <laughs> I also forgot about chlamydia carrots. I'm so sorry. I love you, chlamydia carrots. You're beautiful. So beautiful. Do you know what I'm going to do? I would actually love to get you pregnant again. Because now Feisty Flange is like level 10 in everything. I think now, if we produce offspring, the new horse is going to have like amazing traits, which I think is good. So are they going to mate? Are they going to do it? I don't know if they did it. So who knows? Because I didn't bother look. I'm sorry. I forgot. And do you know what? This Patchy, he's so cute. He's just like mopping my floor. Although he's not helping with the gardening, which is what I got him for, which I genuinely thought he would help with. So that is a spot of bother. Although on a positive note, guys, we got 72,000 simoleons from all this bloody nectar we've been selling. I kind of wanted to buy like some ranch activities to put in the main room. But of course, this pack didn't really come with anything. So there's nothing we can do or nothing I can think of. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know how to enrich their lives a bit more. Anyway, next episode, we will be finally completing Shantan Chantan's aspiration and then we'll be completing the pack. So make sure you do not miss the finale. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one.